I can't believe it's already time for a second semester here at Royal High. I mean, the first semester went by so fast. Zach and I faced trials and tribulations. I admitted that I loved him and it took him a while, but eventually he agreed. We tackled Mean Girls, my best friend moving away, and a lot more. And I really can't wait to see what the second semester here at Royal High holds. Our sophomore year. No more being a silly freshman. Now we're getting closer to ruling the school for our senior year. But I'm thinking way too far ahead. I just can't wait to see what this semester has in store for us. <laughs> oh my gosh, Zach. She is so beautiful. I know. Uh, what do you want to name her? Uh, I don't know. I've always really kind of liked the name Mary. I've always thought it was really pretty. What do you think? Mary, hmm, yeah, I like it. Now class, although these are hyper-realistic robots, they will know if they haven't been fed or changed. So please don't neglect your assignments. We'll be checking in next week. Uh, I have a question. Uh, do these babies, you know, uh, poop? Yes, yes, Zachary. These babies do everything that real babies do. Right, uh, thanks. Come on, Zach, let's go take our robot baby for a walk. Uh, Megan, it's, uh, not a dog. <laughs> I know. It's just an excuse to maybe spend some more time with you. Is that so bad? All right, let's go. I want to show you something that I found. Oh, fresh air. I don't think we've climbed these mountains in... ever. Have you ever been up here before? No, I think it's really dangerous. There could be an avalanche at any moment, and we could be crushed under hundreds of pounds of snow, never to be found again. You've never been up here? You told me you wanted to show me something up here. Should we turn back? Are we going to a dangerous area? Uh, no, I was just trying to hype you up, you know. It's just so, you know, big strong man here to save the day. Oh, okay, well. Avalanches! They're scary! Watch out! So, wow, I can't believe summer's already passed, and we're all the way back here in the winter again for our new semester. So, what exactly did you do over the summer? Well, you know, I mean, I had to get a job because I need money. I'm broke, obviously. I spend a lot of my money on these cool high fashion designer clothes. Uh, and then I needed new video games. I needed the newest video game system, the Soldier Boy console, and all the games it came with, you know, so it cost me a cool $400. Whoa, that's a lot of money, Zach. Yeah, I know. This jacket was like $2,500. You spent $2,500 on a jacket? My mom said it wasn't a good investment, but I told her it is. Over time, it becomes worth more money. Are you at least warm or? No, I'm freezing. It's actually not a good jacket. Oh, okay. But it looks cool. Well, yeah, it does look cool. Well, this summer, I actually volunteered at an animal shelter, and I wanted to adopt absolutely every animal I saw. They're just so cute with their tiny little faces, and they made me feel all warm and cozy, and... I was just so excited to be around so many cute, adorable animals all the time. Wow, that sounds really expensive. To raise like a thousand billion animals sounds pretty expensive. Like, like where do you guys get the money to raise all those animals? We don't. I said I have volunteered at an adoption shelter. Oh, okay. Where do they get the money? Well, I don't know. Funding? Uh, oh. They definitely aren't buying uh, 200, 2,500 2, Gucci dollar jackets. Oh. Wow, that's weird. <laughs> okay, okay, so what did you want to show me? What are we looking for over oh, here? okay, it's up here. Keep coming, we're almost there. Be careful for the avalanche. The avalanches, okay, and I the think the snow we're... monsters. Snow monsters? Yeah, he lurks out here in the deep, deep woods. Oh, okay, no, I think we should go back. I don't want to see any snow no, monsters. No, don't worry, I'm here and he knows not to mess with me. Um, okay, I guess. I've seen him twice and I've laid him out both times. I just don't believe you. Yeah, he's made out of three white snowballs stacked on top of each other. Sometimes he has a carrot nose and sometimes there's more than one of them. That sounds like a snowman. Are you okay? You fought a no, snowman? No, it's a snow monster. Snow monster. Um, okay, not much further. Okay, a little bit further. And we're here. Uh, a teepee in the middle of all this snow? What the heck is that doing here? I don't know. I kind of found it here while Bert and I were playing capture the flag one day. Wait, what? Who the heck is Bert? You guys were playing capture the flag? I'm confused. Oh, uh, sorry, uh, Josh. But uh, he kind of wants to be called Bert now. Bert? That's a strange name. Uh, is there any reason why he wants to go by Bert? <laughs> I guess it makes him sound more industrial, he said. I, I really don't know what that means, but. Uh, industrial, right. Okay, uh, so we'll just call him Bert instead of Josh from now on. Noted. Speaking of Bert, he's calling me right now. 
we're actually roommates again together this year, and uh, I better kind of take this, because I don't want him to take the big room on me. Uh, but I'll see you later when we pick up our schedules. Okay, I hope we have some classes together. I'll talk to you later, Zach. Speaking of roommates, I'm really starting to miss Ash. I actually haven't heard from her pretty much all summer. And we were best friends. I mean, I'm pretty sure we are still best friends. I mean, I haven't met anybody else to replace her with, so I guess I'm gonna probably have to give her a phone call, right? I mean, that's what best friends do. I wonder if she's settling into the new school. I wonder if I could convince her to come back to this school. I wonder who my roommate's gonna be this year. I literally have so many questions and so little time to answer them. My stomach is starting to growl, so sounds like a good time to probably get headed to lunch or breakfast or whatever time of day it is. It seems like we've been out all day. Oh, Royal High. I haven't been here in quite some time. It's just as I remember it. And, oh, this girl's sitting all alone. Ooh. I wouldn't want to sit alone. Can't imagine how sad that would make me. Maybe I should go up and try to talk to her and make friends. I mean, she'd probably like that, right? I mean, uh, I don't know. I haven't tried to make a new friend in a long time. And last time I tried to make a new friend, Sarah and Kelsey, they backstabbed me a whole bunch and made up a bunch of rumors and made me feel bad about myself. Well, I guess you never know unless you never try. Well, here goes nothing. Um, hey there. Uh, how are you doing? Hey, uh, sorry, am I in your way? Oh, no, no, of course, not at all. I was just wondering if maybe I could sit with you. You know, uh, cause I, I didn't really have any friends here anymore, so I thought maybe, you know, we could eat lunch together. Oh, sure. There's plenty of room here. I'm Kirsten. I'm new here. I've transferred over from the castle in the east. Well, transferred is a relative term. I was homeschooled. Oh, it's so great to meet you! Uh, I'm Megan. Wait, did you say the castle back east? And homeschooled? Uh, if you were homeschooled and lived in a castle, does that mean that you're a... Like a... Princess? Oh, no, no, no. Um, I'm, uh... My mom just helps out around the castle. Nothing too fancy. Oh, I see. Yeah, well, that's still really cool. I bet it's so glamorous to live in a castle. I could only imagine all the fancy dinners, the dances, the courtyards, the birds singing, the music playing. Oh, I'm sure you could imagine exactly what it's like to be a princess, though, since you were living there. Oh, it would just be so cool. Yeah, that sounds fantastic. Anyway, I'd better get going. I hear schedules are about to be passed out and I don't want to be late. Oh, uh, okay, well, thanks for chatting, I guess. Uh, I'll, I'll see you later then? Most definitely. Wow, that new girl was really nice. And she was so pretty and sweet and kind. Like I said, the last time I tried to make a friend, it definitely didn't go that well, so I'm excited to see kind of how it ends up going. You know, that's kind of weird. She actually didn't order any food. I, I thought we were gonna eat lunch together, but she kind of got all skittish and ran off. Maybe it was me talking about all the princess stuff too much. Maybe she's just not into that. And I scared her and, you know, maybe she just really wasn't ready for that. No, that's okay. I just got a little too excited, I think. But I should probably just eat lunch and then go grab my schedule. I don't want to be late. And oh boy, I hope I have some classes with Zach. That would be the best thing ever. Hmm, schedule, 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 schedule. <gasps> Ooh, there's my boyfriend, Zach. Zach, Bay, did you get your schedule already? Yeah, I did. I actually have advanced chemistry this year. Uh, yikes, I have no idea why they would put me in that. Oh, me either. Like, I love you and everything, but honestly, you failed that chemistry test hard last semester. Maybe they just really believe in you this year. Oh, please. Well, let's go grab your schedule so we can compare and see what classes we have together. Okay, sounds good. Let's go. Uh, English at 9, baking at 10. Hmm. Oh, look. It looks like we have typing and art together. Oh, really? That's great news. My favorite classes just got even better. Oh, I can feel it, Zach. This year is gonna be our year, and I could not be more excited. Watch out, 2019, Zagan is coming for you.